All right, guys, so today we're gonna talk about a comparison of two multi-tools that I have used and reviewed. The Gerber Dime and the newest, the Gerber Splice. So stay tuned through the intro. <music> What's up? My name is Doug, the Bearded Outdoorsman. Welcome to another video. If you enjoy beard product reviews, gear reviews, EDC videos, then you have definitely come to the right channel. Today, we're doing a side-by-side -side comparison of the Gerber Dime and the Gerber Splice. Now, both of these I have used. I've had the Gerber Dime a lot longer than I've had the Gerber Splice. Uh, we recently did an unboxing and a review of it, but I want to do a side-by-side -side comparison because upon using this, and doing the review, I realized there were a lot of similarities. However, they are greatly different. So, I wanted to come and show you, in case you're on the fence about which one you want to get, I'm going to show you the differences and you can decide. Oh, hey, hey. Hey. Are you enjoying this video? If you are, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Make sure to hit subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, make sure you do that. So let's just start off with price. We'll start with price. So the dime will run you right around $29, okay? And the splice will run you right at $24. So a couple dollar difference. Now let's talk size. Now I don't have exact measurements. That's not how I am. I'm not gonna give you exact measurements. So size, let's go length. They're about the same. Um, the only thing that makes the Gerber dime longer is the bottle opener is exposed. It's out here. Whereas in the splice, the bottle opener is tucked in. So there's that. Then we have thickness. So the thickness on these is almost identical. All right. So thickness is almost identical. Then we go to width and the splice is maybe a quarter of an inch wider than the dime not much all right so size that's your not a whole lot of difference there um the dime had a smaller key ring loop than the splice does now i haven't added any paracord to this um but it has a, a bigger uh key ring loop than the dime does i took the dimes off and put my paracord on the bottle opener seem to work better for me uh because i don't use the bottle opener so there's that now the splice is a 10 in one multi-tool the dime is a 12 in one multi-tool so the big difference is when you open up the dime you have a pair of needle nose pliers with wire cutters and when you open up the splice you have a pair of spring-loaded scissors. So spring-loaded pliers, spring-loaded scissors, no wire cutter, but you have some really, really sharp scissors. Uh, so there's that. Now the dime, yes, you have pliers, but you also have, if I can flip it around so I don't cut myself, a pair of scissors. So you do have scissors. You also have a pair of pliers. Now these scissors aren't nearly as sharp as the splice are big. They're not as big as the splice. Uh, so what tool will work for you? The other thing that the dime has that the splice does not, um, the dime actually has, I have to move my paracord to get them out, which is good so they won't fall out, has a pair of tweezers. All right, metal tweezers, all metal tweezers. The splice doesn't have that. Um, but something the splice has that the dime doesn't have. Let's get her closed up here again so we don't cut ourselves. Wrong side. The splice has a serrated knife blade and a regular knife blade. It has both. Um, so you have a regular blade and a serrated blade. So your dime only has a regular blade. So now, the question just comes is what's going to be more beneficial to you, a pair of needle nose pliers or a pair of heavy duty scissors, a serrated blade or a pair of tweezers. Um, 
other functions are pretty much the same. Both have bottle openers, both have screwdrivers, uh, both have files, um, both actually have scissors, but one's a little more rugged and heavy duty than the other one. So figure out which one's gonna work for you and there you go. So at the end of this video, I'll have a, a card for both review videos of the splice and the dime. So you can get further, more information and you can watch me drill down a little bit more, um, possibly even use these uh, multi-tools and see which one you think works best for you. If you're going just on price, the splice is gonna be cheaper. I'm gonna save you a few dollars on the splice. I'll have links to both of these, by the way, in the description below. You can get over and check them out. Um, but yeah, shoot, you may want one of each. But I like both of these. It's really hard for me to decide because they are so similar. I've had to use the pliers in the dime. Um, I've used the scissors in the splice. So both have come in very, very handy. Really think about what you would use them for um, and go from there. But both of them are really handy and both of them I like. Both of them are very well made. Uh, and both of them are small enough to fit in your pocket. That was why I added this lanyard um, because I carry it in my pocket. I carry it in the same pocket as my wallet. Uh, so this lanyard gives me just a little bit extra grip to find it um, and give me a little bit extra to pull it out. If it's kind of sunk down in the bottom of my pocket, I can, all I got to do is find this and I know it's the dime and I can pull it out. But you have a box blade or a box blade. You have a knife. Um, oh, the other thing that the the dime has that the splice doesn't. It has a package opening blade, which is just a short little little blade here. So, and it only has one knife blade. But the knife blade on the splice is about the same as the dime. So there's not much much difference in that aspect. But, um, but there are some differences. So figure out which one will work for you. Go check out the links below. Go f watch these videos if you want to see me drill them down a little bit more. I think I may give actual specs on size and stuff like that in the review videos. So go check those out. And, um, and yeah, the Gerber Dime and the Gerber Splice. Which one do you prefer? Drop it in the comments. Let me know which one you like better. Which one you own. Um, if, you're, if you own the Dime and you're thinking about the Splice, Drop it in the comments. Let me know which one you think. Which one do you think is better? Um, so, yeah. That's all we got today. So, um, until next time, stay bearded, get outdoors, and God bless.